step by step boat today we shall learn how to make a paper boat using the given steps take a square sheet of paper fold it along the middle horizontally then fold it again vertically as shown you get a folded square now fold one of the flaps backwards fold the remaining three flaps as shown now you get a triangle put your finger inside the triangle to make a cap now make the two ends of the cap meet carefully pull the base pull the flaps outwards press them sideways your boat is ready step by step homemade house fly trap mosquitoes and flies are nasty pests they spread malaria cholera and typhoid we have swarms of flies and mosquitoes in monsoon and winter we try to kill them but it is very difficult to catch a fly or a mosquito so we become the victims of their bites we apply many insecticides but they are not much effective here is an easy solution we can prepare a trap to catch and kill the flies and mosquitoes it is a simple trap to make this trap we require the following things an empty plastic bottle of water a pair of scissors cello tape or gum tape dishwashing liquid and water food items very small pieces of apple 5 grams of sugar and a few drops of lemon juice now let us make the trap for the mosquitoes and flies following the instructions take a plastic bottle cut it into two pieces as shown in the picture remove the cap first turn the small piece upside down put the neck part into the bottle attach the two parts with the staple or a piece of tape put drop the food at the bottom of the bottle our device the mosquito trap is ready hang it inside your house or room now let us see how it works sugar water dish washing liquid and other food items will attract the flies and mosquitoes they will enter the trap they will fall into the liquid their wings will be wet they will not be able to fly back note the distance between the upside down neck and the liquid at the bottom should not be more than 2 cm now let us read the given sentences and write t for true and f for false sentences and also correct the false statements mosquitoes and flies are our competitors false mosquitoes and flies are pests mosquitoes prepare a simple trap to kill man false men prepare a simple trap to kill mosquitoes don't remove the bottom of the bottle true two parts of the bottle are attached true use scissors to cut the food item false use scissors to cut the bottle cello tape Mahesh prepared a mosquito trap he is describing the steps read the steps carefully and fill in their blanks 
using the words given in the brackets took scissors cut upside down removed sticky tape stitched i took a bottle i cut the bottle with scissors i removed the cap then i put the part upside down on the bottle i stitched both the parts with a sticky tape my trap was ready step by step stitching buttons today we shall learn how to stitch buttons for the process of stitching buttons we require things needle thread buttons and a piece of cloth now let us see how to stitch buttons take a needle take a piece of thread put through the pointed thread in the needle's eye match both the ends of the thread make a knot put a button at the proper place of the cloth pierce the needle from beneath the cloth match the button hole and needle point pass the needle through the button hole stretch the needle to the full length pierce the needle beneath the button hole pierce it upward and downward for 3 to 4 times in the end bring the needle beneath the cloth tie knot beneath the cloth and cut the thread now our shirt is ready we have successfully stitched the button in it opening a bank account mahesh wants to open an account in a bank he goes to the bank he meets the manager may i come in sir yes you may what can i do for you I want an SD account to be opened in the bank. Okay, take this form. Fill in the details. So, I have filled up the form. Now paste your photograph and sign it. Here it is. How much money do you want me to deposit? 500 rupees. Okay. Now give your form and money to the cashier. He will give you a passbook. Thank you, sir. Through the conversation between Mahesh and the manager, not only Mahesh, but we also have learned how to open a bank account. Now let us see how Mahesh has filled his bank form. Students Bank of India. CIF number and account number are filled only by the bank staff itself not by us 15th October 2016 personal details customer type public minor yes mr name first name mahesh middle name kumar last name singh name of father first name mr girish middle name kumar last name singh date of birth 14th december 2002 gender male nationality indian mother's maiden name sharma marital status unmarried uid uid of father or mother in case applicant is a minor ab23 phg2 correspondence address current residential office flat number 902 the parker society lion street 
landmark or street opposite to city center city mumbai pin 400058 state maharashtra telephone number 6673829170 mobile number 7788888 Eight nine nine nine. Additional details: Religion Hindu. Category General. Educational qualification: Non-graduate. Occupation type: Student. Proof of identity: Passport. Pan card. Proof of address: Electricity bill. Telephone bill. After filling and rechecking the form at last Mahesh has signed on it Step by step Lemon sharbat Lakshman prepared a set of cards to show how to make lemon sharbat but he forgot to write the instructions for each card Let us see the cards carefully and write instructions for them. Mix well. Cut lemons into half. Take out seeds from the glass. Pour some water in a glass. Add 1 spoon of sugar. Add a little salt squeeze each half piece into the glass now let us write the missing sentences of making lemon sharbat in their correct order lakshman poured some water in the glass he cut the lemons into half He squeezed each half piece into the glass. He took out the seeds from the glass. He added some sugar. He added a little salt. He mixed the sharbat well. Hmm. Now all the sentences are in correct order to make the lemon sharbat. Let us now Answer the following questions. What did Lakshman use to mix sugar? Lakshman used a spoon to mix sugar. How much of sugar did Lakshman add? Lakshman added 1 spoon of sugar. At what time did Lakshman use a spoon? Lakshman used a spoon to take out the seeds, to add sugar, to add salt. and to mix the sharbat what did lakshman do after squeezing the lemon after squeezing the lemon lakshman took out the seeds from the glass why did lakshman add salt in it lakshman added salt for taste step by step electrolysis of water Water is very useful for us. So it is said, water is life. Today we shall read about electrolysis of water. Electrolysis of water is a process to separate the hydrogen and oxygen in the water with the help of electrolytic cell or charged battery. Materials used for the experiment are half cut plastic jar two screws copper wire two test tubes dry battery cell or 6 volt battery and sulfuric acid procedure take a plastic jar half cut as shown in the figure make two holes at the bottom fit the holes with the screws remember there should not be any water leakage Join the outer ends of the screws with a battery 
or a dry cell. This is our voltmeter. Now, fill half of the voltmeter with pure water. Add four or five drops of sulfuric acid. The water will become a good conductor. Arrange two test tubes completely filled with water upside down on the screw in such a way that water does not come out from test tube. The screw attached or joined with positive terminal of battery acts as a node and screw joined with negative terminal of battery acts as cathode. Now complete the circuit and start the current and observe what appears in test tubes on both the terminals. Observation By observing test tube on both the terminals, a gas with bubbles comes out which moves upward in test tubes and the level of water decreases. After some time, observe the proportion of gas collected in both the test tubes. On which terminal the proportion of gas is found more in test tube? Observation After some time, if proportion of gas is observed in both the test tubes, then the test tube at the negative terminal has more amount of gas. Now, put thumb near the mouth of test tube on the negative terminal. Take out the test tube and bring a burning matchstick near it. Observe what happens. Observation Take out test tube of negative terminal and keep it erect. When a burning matchstick is brought in front of the test tube, gas burns with explosion. Now, take out the test tube at the positive terminal and insert a smoking incense stick into the test tube. Observe what happens. In the test tube, when the smoking incense stick is inserted, it burns with a flame. Conclusion Thus, water is made up of gases. If current is passed through water, these gases are separated. When the proportion of gases is observed in both the test tubes, the proportion of gas formed at the negative terminal is more than the gas at the positive terminal. When we take out the test tube placed on the negative terminal and put it near a burning matchstick, it burns with an explosion, popping sound, because hydrogen gas is a combustible gas. It proves that the gas liberated at the cathode is hydrogen. When we take out the test tube placed on the positive terminal and insert a smoking incense stick into it, the incense stick burns because oxygen gas which supports combustion is present in the test tube. This proves that the liberated gas in test tube is oxygen. Step by step Mega Ride Gujarat is a progressive state. Ahmedabad is the largest city and center of business in Gujarat. Gandhinagar is the capital of Gujarat. About 50,000 people every day travel between these two capitals, old and new. So we need a good transport facility. The government of Gujarat planned for a new railway project. The government started a 2,000 crores company for that project. The name of the company is Mega. MEGA Metro Link Express for Gandhinagar and Ahmedabad 
The cost for this project is about 1,200 crores. This metro rail project has two phases. In the first phase, there will be three lines. North-South Corridor, East-West Corridor and Underground Corridor. Total length of the three lines will be 76 kilometers. The North-South Corridor will connect Ashram Road to Gandhinagar. This corridor will be 32.65 meters long. It will start from APMC Vasna on National Highway 8A. It will pass through Vasna, Paladi, VS Hospital and Town Hall. This line will cross the East-West Corridor at Income Tax Junction. It will turn a little left near Koba Circle and will run towards Gandhinagar. There are two more junctions on this line. Info City and Gift City. There will be 31 stations on this corridor. Now, let us go on the East-West Corridor. It will start from Kalupur. It will run through the main areas of Ahmedabad. Then the line will turn south towards IT Circle. It will go towards Commerce Crossing. Thaltej Crossing will be the last station of this route. It will be the terminus on East-West Corridor. Total length of this line will be 10.90 kilometers. It will connect the Eastern and Western Ahmedabad. Most of the metro route will be on pillars and over bridges. This will be called elevated route. The travelers will enjoy the beautiful scenes in the town. It will be a lovely view to see metro trains running on elevated tracks. You will be able to travel without tickets in this metro rail. You can use smart card facility. You can enter a station with your smart card. You swipe the smart card at your exit station. The system will automatically count the travel charges. The trains will run without drivers. But you need not worry. Technology will take care of your safety. CBTC, Communications Based Train Control, Signaling Technology will make your travel safe. All the metro cars will be air-conditioned. The train will travel at the maximum speed of 110 km per hour. Ready for the ride? Wow! That is such a big project government has planned for us. Mega Ride will surely help us a lot. Now, let us read the given sentences and put a cross on the wrong option and make the statement true. The east-west corridor will connect two parts of Ahmedabad. Travelers will travel in mega trains with a smart card. Most of the metro trains will run on elevated route. The mega trains will run without drivers. The terminus for east-west corridor will be Thaltej Crossing. Now let us answer a few questions based on Mega Ride. How many lines will be in the first phase of Mega? Name them. There will be three lines in the first phase of Mega North-South Corridor. East-West Corridor, Underground Corridor. Which line will connect Eastern and Western Ahmedabad? The East-West Corridor will connect the Eastern and Western Ahmedabad. What will be the total distance between Kalupur and Thaltej Crossing? The total distance between Kalupur and Thaltej Crossing will be 10.90 kilometers. 
What does it mean by elevated route? The elevated route will be on pillars and over bridges. Write three specialities of mega trains. It will have smart card facility. Trains will run without drivers. All metro cars will be air conditioned. Former President of India Pratibha Patil will meet students at Mahatma Mandir on 15th January. You will reach Ahmedabad from your place. Which mega route will you take to reach Mahatma Mandir? If I am at the railway station or the bus stop, I will take the east-west corridor to reach Mahatma Mandir. If I am in Ahmedabad, around Vasna, Paladi, Town Hall or VS Hospital, I will take the north-south corridor to reach Mahatma Mandir. Step by Step One Day Trip If we want to plan a one day trip with our friends at low cost, and also have a lot of fun at the same time, then we need to decide on a few things. Given below are some questions that help us in planning our trip. Let us read and answer them. Where will you go? Nearby farm? Nearby bazaar? Nearby water park? Nearby farm? How will you go? On the bicycle? By shared rickshaw? Friend's car? On the bicycle? What will you carry? Fruits? Ready-made snacks? Raw material for cooking? Raw material for cooking? What will you do there? We will play games, sing, Dance, cook food and enjoy ourselves. What will be the cost of your trip? Ticket from my city, town, village, zero. Food items on the way, zero. Lunch, 200. Sightseeing tickets, zero. Shopping, zero. Auto fares, Zero. Miscellaneous expenses, 100. Total, 300. Let us now read, recite and enjoy the poem, Tree Huggers. Release it now, just like a big balloon. A prayer to reach the mountains of the moon. To citizens of earth, alas we say, Go find yourself a tree to hug today. And if a grown-up says, don't be a fool, or is that what they're teaching you in school? Just find this poem and read this simple rhyme. It's cool to hug a tree from time to time. Children, this is how the world can be. Making Earth Plan A and not plan B. Wear change, share change, sing change, bring change, and start by hugging a tree. <laughs>